So here's my HD antenna configured. I haven't soldered it. I still have to solder it, but I put it outside. Um, and as you can see, mine's a lot thinner. If you look here, and then we uh, we got the glue on the back from Gino to cover all the screws, and I've just got it running inside here. And as you can kind of see, I've got uh, what 12. 12 digital channels now. Um, I went up from 3 to 12, 13, and it gets the analog channels as well. So pretty nifty. We'll see how many uh, how many total I get. It looks like uh, 13. And as you can see there, it automatically went to the first analog channel. And there's HD. And uh, there's HD and there's HD uh, it's the weather looks like uh, the west side's getting some fun weather and this should be channel 7 HD and there's analog channel 7 and there's HD channel 7 and what else do we have here? There's channel 7, their extra channel, RT, HD. Oh, there's another, the weather channel in HD. Cool. More analog, analog. And I'll just remove these analog ones. Um, not sure what channel this is, but yeah, lots of HD channels. So thanks to Bob and Eat LVA for... Uh, letting us know about this little project. Again, I only have the antenna up about five feet in the air, so I'm sure if you got it a lot higher, you'd get quite a few more stations and make a few connections, but it does work, so here you go. Video proof positive. W8VAD. So, as you can see, the HD TV is working, and we also get a couple of analog channels as well. Um,